Howdy. Howdy, friends and neighbors. Won't you step up and shake my hand? I'm an old apple knocker and a pea picker, too. I'm going to make a friend of somebody, and it looks like it's you. So, howdy. Is that good enough for an opening? How about that? Anyway, this is me, Rusty78609 in Central Texas, USA, in my luxurious 26-foot travel trailer, a Jayco J flight. More luxury over here. Got a wash machine right there and a chair. Got all that stuff. Anyway, it's, uh, I don't know, it's a beautiful afternoon. It's around 70 degrees, partly cloudy, good enough to do a video. And uh, had a comment. One of them wanted to know about my home base, so we'll touch on that. This is it. Covered by an aluminum cover, 26-foot RV, 15 by 18 wooden deck. Steps, steps, that's it. Um, five, three, four, three lots, three lots, three lots. And it backs up to a ranch behind you there. It's pretty nice. It's pretty private, very private actually. But anyway, I had a comment about uh, the weather in central Texas. And I, I don't know if you can hear this or not. I hope you can. But anyway, <clears throat> but anyway, one guy asked about, you know, what I, what did I do? Uh, during thunderstorms and tornadoes and stuff like that. Well, folks, let me tell you something about that. <clears throat> we don't get many of those in Central Texas. Now, north of us, Dallas, Wichita Falls, Vernon, Texas, that is called Tornado Alley, and they get a lot of them, and they get them in the spring. But be that as it may, if you were living in that, under this, and there was a tornado that came right through here, <clears throat> right through here, say a semi-direct hit, uh, they wouldn't even, <clears throat> they wouldn't even find my sunglasses, okay? That'd be, they might find those. So, what I would do is I have a Toyota Prius parked right there, my plan. This is a good plan. Will it work? Probably not. But it's better than nothing. <clears throat> you know, they say get in a low spot. No, I'm not going to lay down with the fire ants. That's out. So, in my Toyota Prius right there, if it's if somebody bumps into it real hard, it, it deploys airbags. It's got, I don't know, it's probably got six or eight airbags in that thing. So what my plan is, is to get in there, you know, and put it in the drive mode. That's a honeybee, and he's the honeybee's in love with me. And but anyway, but my plan would be to get inside that uh, vehicle. Get it in the start mode, but leave the brake on. And if the tornado hits and it sucks the car up in the air, and then the car hits on the ground or something hits the car, it would deploy the airbag. Would I survive? 50-50. Better than zero right there. But anyway, so what else is going on? Not much. Not a whole lot. I uh, fixed to go walking again. I went walking this morning. I fixed to do it. Oh, this is December the 23rd, 2016. And it's a beautiful day, beautiful, for you guys that live up in the northern parts of the universe. Well, good luck in this winter, because I, I couldn't stand the cold weather. But uh, but anyway, I had another comment uh, from one guy. He says, uh, you know, I had such a, a great personality, he couldn't imagine why a woman would divorce me. Ha! Huh. When the money's gone, honey, the honey's gone. Trust me. That's the way life is. Is that bad? No, sir. Just the way it is. Deal with it. So having said that, this is a, this may not be a viral video like the rest. This, you know, I've got to settle it down a little bit. You know, I don't want to, I don't want to get up into the top tax bracket. I want to stay, you know, right down there under the radar, so to speak. Well, I, if I get much farther under the radar, I will be in the core of the earth. So having said that, guys. Christmas is coming, the lights are on the tree, and I didn't have anything to do, so I made this video. I was trying to make a poem out of that, but I screwed up the words. <laughs> anyway, guys, y'all have a good day. I'm just killing time here on my patio in Central Texas, USA. And, uh, you know, you know, I should not be left alone too long because my little brain, you know, I'm just creating shit all the time. Well, I got to tell you, you can go through life 
You can go through life at my age like this, okay? Or you can go through it like this. <laughs> you know what I mean? Do-da, do-da. I prefer the do-da. You know, this, you know, I see these old guys, you know, you know, they, do, they always jerk this arm. I, I, don't, I don't know what that is. I guess that's to give them perpetual motion or something. But, you know, they'll put the stick out and then they do this kind of thing. And, you know, you got to get, you, you know, uh, George Burns said something one time. That, you know, you got to, that people actually practice at getting old. You know, like when you're about 60 years old or so, when you get out of a chair, you kind of go, mm, you know, you kind of groan. Well, you know, it, and by the time you, you're 70 and 80, you've got it down. I mean, you, you, you do the perfect grunt when you get up or groan, you know what I mean? And, uh, but anyway, in all this luxury, folks, look upon my wealth, ye mighty, and weep. <laughs> my washing machine and... Uh, my chair, you see what that, well, maybe you can't see it, but there's a spot right here on this chair. Maybe you can see it, maybe you can't. A cat did that, and I shot it with a BB pistol. It didn't hurt. It scared the crap out of the cat, but the cat ain't been back to scratch on it anymore either. Anyway, guys, thumbs up, carpe diem, adios, bye-bye, buy USA made, drink plenty of water, take deep breath, in through your nose, out through your mouth, and let me show you something. Stretch. Just like that, but just stretch it up there, and a lot of you may not even be able to do that. Okay, and stretch again, take deep breaths as you're doing it, baby. You'll feel better, I guarantee you. And then do some of this. This looks kind of like it's not much exercise, but I promise you, it's stretching those muscles, and you'll feel very, very good. And another one is just to stretch out front with your arms and pull in. Stretch out and pull in and stretch out and pull in and then do one like this that kind of gets some more of them like that And then you can just do like this and go around like this Okay You know I, and I do that I do about 20 or 30 reps of all of those twice a day and then when I finish I do this and this right here stretches those muscles on the backs of your legs. And what that'll do is if you get cramps in your toes at night and you do this leaning exercise either against the wall or laying down on the floor and pulling your toes towards you, you won't get those cramps in your feet while you're sleeping. Why? Because there's an acid that builds up in your muscles and whenever you do that, it moves that acid out in the bloodstream and you pee pee it out. And so it doesn't bother you at night. It doesn't cause your muscles to go eat like that. So what a video this has been. Anyway, thumbs up, Carpe Diem, and all that stuff. Enjoy your day. Christmas is coming. The lights are on the tree. Bye-bye from me. <laughs> what, a, what a silly video, huh?